Hi all, welcome to our YouTube channel. So we are back again with the most important questions from Pilium 2020 and the word of the day is motivation. So let's begin with the first question. Which of the following country borders Red Sea? First Djibouti, second Egypt, third Oman, fourth Sudan, fifth Eritrea. Select the correct code. A. All of the above. B. 2, 3, 4 only. C. 1, 2, 4, 5 only. D. 3 only. So you can pause the video and mention your answers in the comment section below. So guys, the correct answer here is C. 1, 2, 4, 5 only. Now the reason being Oman does not border the Red Sea. Alright. So now let's look at how the bordering takes place. I'll just pick a color here. So now this is your eastern side and this will be your western side. Alright. So here you have two countries. You have Saudi Arabia and here you have Yemen. Alright. And this is of course your Red Sea. Okay. Now here on the uh, western margin. Now please be very careful here. Starting may you have Egypt. Then you have Sudan, alright. Then you have Eritrea, chotu sa yaha pe. And then you have Djibouti, alright. Yaha pe aapka Gulf of Aden aa jata hai, alright. I'll just pick another color. And yaha pe, most importantly, there is a strait here, alright. Now I want you to mention in the comment section which strait connects the Gulf, sorry, the Red Sea to the Gulf of Aden, alright. So mention your answers in the comment section. We'll discuss this in the next video. Alright, so I'll just repeat once again. On the eastern side, you have Saudi Arabia and Yemen. On the western side, you have um, Egypt, Sudan, Eritrea and Djibouti. Alright, so let's move on. Now select the correct statement about the Life Insurance Company of India using the quotes given below. First, in a joint stock life insurance company, the company has no capital to begin with. Second, in a mutual stock life insurance company, the company has some capital to commence its business with. Now, the correct answer, oh, sorry, before we move on, the quotes are A, 1 only, B, 2 only, C, both, D, none. So, the correct answer here is D, none. Alright, now the reason being is that now, the joint stock life insurance company has some capital to begin, okay. They have certain amount of capital base, whereas in the uh, mutual um, stock life insurance company, they do not have any capital to begin with, alright. So, please note that. Uh, and also, uh, the life insurance company of India is a mutual stock company, okay, but benefits of its business go fully to the government of India. So, please note that because in other countries, of the world, uh, some of the profits are shared with the uh, policy make ho holders themselves, alright. But in India, the entire profit goes fully to the government of India. So, moving on to the next question. Consider the following statement. First statement. The Himalayan ibex and Siberian ibex are estimated to have diverged from the alpine apex during the Pleistocene epoch. Second, the Siberian apex is on Ibex is on the least concerned species of the IUCN red list. Third, in India, the Ibex is distributed in the Union territories of Ladakh and Jammu and Kashmir only. Now, which of the following statements here are correct? A. 1 only. B. 1 and 3 only. C. 1 and 2 only. D. 2 only. So, guys, the correct answer here is D. 2 only. Alright. Now, the reason being First of all, one must understand it is the Siberian apex which has uh, estimated to have diverged from the Alpine apex during the Pleistocene epoch and not the Himalayan. Okay, it is just the Siberian apex. Therefore, statement one is incorrect. Now, the third statement is that uh, in India, the Siberian uh, sorry the Himalayan ibex is distributed in. Let's start from the uh, in the Trans Himalayan range of the Union Territory of Ladakh. Jammu and Kashmir, Himachal Pradesh also, which is up to Satluj, alright. So, therefore, the statement third is incorrect. Now, basically, what exactly is an ibex? It is, it is a wild mountain goat, alright. So, please note that. And why was it 
this in news recently it's because uh, the zoological uh, survey of india has conducted a study which shows that the genetic analysis has suggested that the uh, himalayan ibex is very genetically different from all the other uh, uh, ranges of uh, siberian ibex and other which are found in different countries all right so basically what they did is that they collected the fecal samples from uh, lahore and spiti and through this uh, they came to the conclusion that our himalayan ibex is a very genetically different species all right also one must understand this entire project is funded by the national mission on himalayan studies okay so the correct answer is two only which, which means siberian ibex is on the least concerned species and one and three are incorrect all right so moving on to the next question exercise red flag is conducted by which of the following country first united states of america second india third china fourth russia so guys the correct answer here is to india all right so basically this uh, uh, whole exercise red flag is conducted by the usa and only countries which are considered friendly towards the united states of america take part in it all right and recently our uh, uh, indian air force uh, took part in it all right so also before i move on uh, the red flag is basically a multilateral air exercise all right which is held several times a year it, and it offers a very realistic uh, air combat training for for military pilot and other flight crew members all right so that's that So moving on to the fifth question consider the following statement first statement the prime minister citizen assistant relief in emergency situation fund is a public charitable trust second statement contribution to this fund will be considered as social welfare spending under companies law third prime minister is the chairman of this fund and the members include ministers from defense home and finance ministry now which of the following statement here are correct a 1 and 2 only b all c 2 and 3 only d 2 only so guys the correct answer here is b all all the statements here are correct now recently this uh, particular fund was in news because of the covid 19 situation all right so moving on to the next question which of the following statement with reference to the nk singh committee is or are correct first nk singh committee was set up to suggest changes to fiscal responsibility and budget management act second the committee suggested that the government must borrow from the rbi except only when the rbi subscribe to government securities to finance any deviation to select the correct answer using code mentioned below a both b none c one only d two only so guys the correct answer here is c one only all right now statement 2 is incorrect because there is not one reason there are basically three reason all right so the committee suggested uh three other conditions and they are the first one is obviously when the rbi subscribe to government securities to finance any deviation and the second one is except when center has to meet a temporary shortfall in receipts all right and the third is rbi purchases government security from secondary market all right so these are the three conditions so therefore the statement 2 is incorrect moving on to the next question oh and before i move further uh what exactly is your uh, fiscal responsibility in budget management act now basically there are three very very important objective of this the first one is to reduce uh the fiscal deficit the second one is to introduce transparency in fiscal management uh, system in india and the third one is to achieve fiscal stability in the long run all right so these are the fiscal dis disciplines which this particular act uh, brings into picture now why this particular news uh, was uh in new, uh, this particular information was in news is because uh, the kerala proposes to borrow around uh, uh 12000 uh, sorry 12 lakh 500 cr from the market and has urged the center to give it flexibility under this particular act 
through the escape clause all right now uh, wherein now what is the escape clause it's basically where the center can exceed the annual fiscal deficit target all right now kerala has done this in order to ensure the state finances are not adversely affected in rest of the financial year and uh, in order to uh, uh, mitigate the impact on livelihoods and overall economic activity that has been a uh, cause due to the covid-19 situation all right so therefore the statement 2 is incorrect moving on to the next question panchkula district is in which of the following state of india a haryana b bihar c uttar pradesh d rajasthan so now guys the correct answer here is a haryana all right now the reason being uh, why this particular information was in news because recently the depart uh, the sorry the deputy commissioner of uh, panchkula under the punjab village and small town act has passed an order uh, that uh, the inhabitants especially the male of the village will be liable for patrol duty during this uh, lockdown situation all right now uh, also before i move further panchkula uh, name originates from the five irrigation canal that meet in this particular area and they distribute water from the ghagar hakra river now this is very important ghagar hakra river is important because a lot of mature harappan uh, sites have been found in this particular uh, basin all right so moving on to the next question Stranded in India is a portal launched by which of the following Ministry of India? A Ministry of Tourism, B Ministry of Home Affairs, C Ministry of External Affairs, D Ministry of Health and Family Welfare. So now the correct answer here is A Ministry of Tourism. All right. So it is basically a, a portal uh, to support the foreign tourists which are uh, stranded abo- abroad by the Tourism Ministry, and this will basically disseminate information. Um, on tourists or uh, sorry to tourists which are stuck there to uh, amidst the covid-19 pandemic that has taken place all right so moving on to the next question consider the following statement first sodium hypochlorite which is used in bleaching agent is corrosive in nature second at 1% solution it causes damage to skin and if ingested can cause serious lung damage third sodium hypochlorite releases chlorine which is used to sanitize pool which of the following statement are correct a all b one and two only c two only d three only so now um the correct answer here is a all of the above all right now one must also understand that even a 0.25% or less than that chemical is used to treat skin wound like cuts or like scrapes or and a much much uh, lower concentration is used as a hand wash so it is quite a, a dangerous uh, chemical so why this particular information was in news is because recently a lot of migraine migraine workers which are which were traveling back to their hometowns were sprayed with this in order to sanitize them all right so moving on to the next question consider the following statement first statement the sun radio interferometer space experiment relies on six p- powered cube satellites to study the working of solar system second this program designed by the european space agency in collaboration with uh, isro choose the correct statement using the codes given below a both b none c one only d two only so now guys the correct answer here is c one only all right now the reason the second statement is incorrect because this program is designed by nasa all right so please note that and this will basically study how the sun generates and release a giant uh, space weather storm all right which is also known as a uh, solar particle storm into the planetary system now this will basically help our astronauts and other astronauts which are traveling to moon and to mars by providing them with better information as to how the sun's radiation affect the entire space environment all right so the second statement here is incorrect please note that so that's it for the day and for more information on our various courses please visit our website www.ashas.com and for more such daily videos like share and subscribe to our youtube channel thank you